Hi, this is Adam with Small Down Machine Shop. Today I'm going to do a quick little review video on the Tessman Focus TSM192. Now, they did send this to me for free. I did not, I denied any other kind of compensation like I always do. I have a lot of few things from Tessman and I've been happy with all of it. For a budget meter, which is, that's what this is, they're very, very good. Uh, I have a couple in, I have one in each of my trucks. That's my, uh, you know, on the road meter. I like the size of it. They, they're very basic, very easy to use. Power on. This one's auto. So you stick the probes in, and I'll show you on an outlet. Uh, you don't have to switch it, but I switch the voltages and whatnot. It's got a good light on it, which I, I actually use it a lot as a light in the engine bay at night and stuff like that. And it's good for probing in like electrical control boxes, like on the machines and stuff. And then it's got a hold function. So uh, I'll show you that. And then it's got the about the glare there this is the no contact thing uh, let me grab a cord here and here's a random extension cord on the ground here you hear it beep in there and it's very sensitive uh, I've held this up to my phone charger cord, which is only like five volts. Yeah, picks that up. And you can do a phase rotation too. I don't have a good way to show you that, but it is for a, a meter this small and economical to have phase rotation. If you don't know, uh, when you do three phase stuff, you can check the rotation before you hook a motor to it. And that comes into play mostly, from my understanding, in like the uh, refrigeration, uh, HVAC type stuff for compressors and stuff. But it's in the shop as well. It's got leads, the covers on them. I usually leave them on, they're nice, nice and sharp. They'll poke through a wire no problem. Uh, it's the holiday season. These are, these little meters is what I give out as a, make an excellent stocking stuffer. It comes in a case and everything. It comes with batteries. And it's just a good, they're good solid meters for the price. Now I know people are saying, well, it's not a fluke. Well, yeah, 99% of you don't need a fluke. <laughs> I do big wiring on, you know, big motors and stuff. And I don't even have a fluke meter, so... For the basic homeowner or, you know, DIY guy that needs to check some voltages and stuff, perfect meter for that. So, yeah, now let me take it over to a, uh, let me bring the other end of the cord over here, and I'll uh, show you how it works. Okay, so we got it in auto. Here's an extension cord. If you're not comfortable around electrical stuff, don't do this kind of stuff. <laughs> so let's say this was a socket. The ground there. It lights up. 123 volts. That was just power there. Another thing, it will. This is an auto feature. It'll also do continuity. So yeah, you can just leave it there, and it'll do all its things, without you uh, having to change it. Put it back in there. Very easy to use, very good tool for the shop. Get one, throw it in your car, uh, throw it in your to-go bag, your, uh, you know, when you fix stuff outside the shop and all that. Highly, highly recommend. Again, I get sent a shocking amount of things for how small my channel is, and I don't show you guys half of it probably, because 
like I said before, a lot of stuff I get sent is carnival prizes. <laughs> but these, I've always been very happy with them. Uh, I actually have their newest meter too. I'm reviewing it. I'm, I'm using it right now. But yeah, you really can't go wrong with these uh, Tessman meters. There'll be a link down in the description to this meter. Again, I don't get any kind of, I always deny any kind of payments or any of that stuff. So I can keep it honest for you. Here you go. I would highly recommend this. So go ahead and pick one up. This is Adam for Small Town Machine Shop. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.